What's up everyone? Drew Snipes here with Beers and Gears. And on today's episode we're going to do some fun, fun guitar stuff. Uh, we're going to do a pedal demo. I want to see if the pocket metal from Horse can stand up against the Digitech death metal pedal. See how close we can get the pocket metal to sound like the death metal. Um, I was going to go HM2, but I figured that wasn't really fair. So, death metal it is. Also wanted to show some upgrades on the Hammer Slammer that I plan on doing. Uh, the Hammer Slammer has become the backbone of my channel. Uh, used it on every pedal demo that I've done uh, all the way back to the beginning of the climb up the Boss Mountain. So I think it was time to give it some upgrades. The tuners were slipping a little bit. The uh, E-tuner e is, is about to break, I feel. So I'm going to replace them. I'm going to replace the pickup. But I'm going to show you what I've done so far. I've uh, replaced uh, the bridge. The tone knob, the volume knob. I've also replaced the output jack cover to all black hardware. So let's show you what I'm what else I'm gonna do. As far as the pickup, just for the bridge, uh, I'm going I went with a Dragonfire pickup brand. This is their hex bucker. I think this is going to be really awesome. Definitely cut through, a little high output pickup. Um, $50 humbucker into a $50 guitar. If you want, if you go back to the video of where I reviewed the Hammer Slammer, I got this off of eBay for $50. Uh, it didn't have a bridge, no, and just if you see how beat up it is, all the clear coat is chipping off. But as soon as I felt the neck, I loved it. So I wanted to upgrade it. So, Dragonfire Hexbucker pickup for the bridge. Keeping the single coils in the neck and middle. Also to replace the tuners, going with the uh, Tone Ninja tuners. These are locking staggered tuners. I thought these were really cool looking. Um, definitely cheaper than um, hip shot or shaler but I didn't really want to put expensive pickups on a cheap guitar so we're gonna see how these go hopefully these work out great they look great they feel great so we'll see what happens when we actually put strings on them I kinda like the logo the packing job on these were, were pretty awesome I mean this is pretty nice packaging so six in line stagger tuners black hardware these are gonna be great all right now that that's out of the way let's move ourselves into a pedal demo so as always hammer slammer centaur hammer slammer into the pedals into the boss katana mini on the clean channel this is the Hammer Slammer Clean. Detect death metal. Great pedal, love it. Now going over to the pocket metal, let's see what sounds we can get out of this thing. Um, if you missed my video on this pedal, the review, so you got a mid sweep, distortion and volume knobs, true bypass. <laughs>
HM2 on me here. Um, sounds really awesome. Just as a comparison, I don't have an HM2 near me at the moment. Let's throw it up against the TC Electronic iMaster. Now these are the $40 or $50 pedals now. The TC Electronic is kind of good. Let's throw these two up against each other. So, pocket metal. TC Electronic, I Master. Pocket Master, po that Pocket Metal, that sounds really awesome. Uh, Pocket Master, combine them both together. Uh, Pocket Master, that's pretty awesome. That's very, uh, very close to the iMaster. I guess it would be closer to the HM2 as well. That's pretty awesome. Um, I don't know, what are these, $23? You get HM2 sound for $23? <laughs> pocket metal better than the eye master on this the way it's set up because I think there's a little bit too much bass boom on the eye master pocket metal feels a little tighter that's pretty great um, yeah go back to the pocket metal man that thing's awesome $23 for that kind of sound awesome all right that's it kind of turned into a little uh, heavier pedal uh, comparison than I thought it would but fun video as always I want to thank you guys for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Putting out videos every uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, and doing pedal demos, guitar demos, reviews, upgrades, all kinds of fun stuff. I'm trying to keep things interesting. Uh, if you guys know anything about these Dragonfire pickups or Tone Ninja tuners, please let me know. Uh, open to feedback. Maybe they suck. Maybe I need better ones. Maybe I had a good deal. Uh, please let me know in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. This is Drew Snipes with Beers and Gears. Out. Uh -huh.